And we're back, guys. Welcome to Tennis in a Minute. I'm your host, Good Energy. After taking the first set, Jill Teichman, we have an upset alert, ladies and gentlemen. Rebecca Peterson would bounce back in the second set, and we pick up here in the third set, ladies and gentlemen. I said in the previous video, in the preview and prediction video, I think Rebecca Peterson is the better shot maker. I do think Jill Teichman has a crafty left forehand. She's fit. She's athletic. But much like most of the left-handed players, when you see them go to their backhand, they're normally in trouble during that rally or they're trying to gain some type of court position. And listen, guys, look at him. Bernard Pera, great left forehand. You know, look at uh, Layla Fernandez, great left forehand. Angelique Kerber, great left forehand. Jill Teichman, great left forehand. All of the left-handed players have these amazing left forehands, but when you see them go to that backhand, they're normally in trouble. And Rebecca Peterson is the type to go 20 shots deep. Listen, guys, a four-hour marathon match to Kat McNally. Was she tired? No. You saw in the first set, Jill Teichman, yes, it's hot out here. You saw her starting to get tired, and I said to myself, listen, is she going to be able to hang? I said that in the last video. Can she hang with the Rebecca Peterson who loves these long shot rallies? And l listen, in the third, especially the second set where Rebecca forced the third set, you started to see Jill Teichman start to get really aggressive and take risks and make some bad decisions. And she was missing badly. Rebecca Peterson gets to break. to And look at her. She looks tired there. She gets to break to start the third set. And she never looked back there, breaking Jill Teichman multiple times to end this match. And of course, Rebecca on the money line lock. <laughs> Listen, guys, I had to take it twice, not once, twice on the lock. Yes, it was a numeric lock, ladies and gentlemen. Rebecca Peterson was not going to lose this match. And when she dropped the first set, even more value. You got her as a 6-1 to one underdog to win, nearly a 2-1 to one underdog before the match started. I took her to win the match. It's a numeric lock. I gave you guys the easy pick to take her on the 4.5 spread. That was minus 200. Look, I took her on the money line. Numeric lock. She's not going to lose the match. Just a better shot maker, like I said, in my opinion. Better stamina. And that's what it's going to come down to. Jill made some very bad decisions, uh, but I don't think she had any choice. She was exhausted. Rebecca Peterson is back, guys. Remember, Rebecca Peterson won a set off the great Serena Williams. She had Serena in trouble. Rebecca's back, guys. Good energy. Show some love. Like the video. We'll be right back at you.